Visit our website for some more home construction tips and advice. Here's another house framing tip for contractors, homeowners, and do-it-yourselfers. Framing bottom plates normally aren't going to be a problem unless the engineer is specifying different sized building plates. So, in other words, instead of just having a regular 2x4 or 2x6 bottom plate, some structural engineers are requiring 3x4 and 3x6 bottom plates. So, if this is the situation on the home you're working on, make sure that the anchor bolts are laid out correctly and they're sticking up high enough. I can't tell you how many times I've went to a job that just had the anchor bolt sticking up because they were thinking it was just going to be two by fours, but they're three by fours. And we have to um, shave in to the anchor bolts, which realistically the structural engineer is not going to like. Um, so to do it right, um, we would have to re-epoxy um, new anchor bolts into the, into, um, into the 3x4. Now this becomes a problem if you're working on an existing raised floor foundation and the uh, engineer is calling out for a 3x bottom plate and then you already have existing 2x6 floor joists sitting on top of a 2x4 bottom plate. Um, now what's going to be required is you need to raise the building, put the 3x4 plate in, notch the floor joist, and lower the thing. This isn't going to make the engineer happy. So check with the engineer. These 3x4 um, and 3x6 bottom plates have been kind of confusing a lot of framers for, for quite some time now. Um, if you have them on your plans, uh, make sure that they actually work with the project and make sure that you install these things. They're very important. The last thing you're going to want to run into is needing to install a 3x4 plate because you installed a 2x4 plate, but you have shear panel and floor framing attached to this thing. So pay attention. This is becoming a new thing. It's been around for a while, but it is confusing a lot of framers. Feel free to visit some of our other websites for more helpful tips on home construction and remodeling.